In this video, I'm going to quickly get you up to speed writing index and match formulas, which are much more efficient, flexible, and robust than VLOOKUP. We'll look at each function in turn to understand how they work, and then we'll write index and match formulas together. Before we start, if you have Excel 2021 or later, or Microsoft 365, then you should be using the new XLOOKUP function, and there's a link in the video description to my comprehensive XLOOKUP tutorial. We'll dive right into some examples to understand the function syntax. So starting with index. In its simplest form, the index function returns a value of a cell at the intersection of the row and column that you provided. For example, we can use index to look up this table here and return the value for Batman, which we can see is on the second row for the North region, which we can see is in the third column. Close parentheses and index returns 91. Easy, huh? However, on its own, the index function is pretty inflexible because you have to hard key the row and column number, but we can make it dynamic with the match function. And that's because match returns the position of an item in an array. So if we want to look up Batman in this column here, and the match type we want is zero for exact match, it returns two. And we can feed that formula into the index function row number argument. Likewise, if we want to find the column number for north in this row here with an exact match, it returns a three. And likewise, we feed that into the index functions column number argument. Let's put them together now to replicate a VLOOKUP formula. Now I want to index the table I'm going to absolute reference the range so that when I copy the formula down, it stays fixed on the table. And for the row number argument, we're going to use match to look up the program selected here. And I'm going to absolute reference that. And then we're going to look it up in this column. Again, absolute reference with F4. We want an exact match. And then for the column number, we're going to again use match to look up the region that's selected here, I don't need to absolute reference this because I want to copy it down and it update the row reference. We're looking it up in this row, which I need to absolute reference. And we want an exact match, which is zero. Close match, close index. And there we have the program views for Ben 10 in the East region is 107. And I'm just going to right click and drag fill without formatting to copy the formula down. Now notice that the region order in the table is not the same as the region order I have here. It's east and then it should be north, south, west. But index and match handle this with ease. And if I change the program selected at the top, it updates accordingly. Another thing the index and match formulas can do that VLOOKUP can't is look up columns to the left. For example, let's say I want to look up a channel and find the program that's on. Now I can use index to simply index the program column. I don't need to index the whole table. I know I just want the program column returned. So let's just reference that. And then we'll use match to look up crafty kids and it's in this column here. We want an exact match, which is zero. Close match. Now, because I've only selected one column in index's array argument, I don't need to enter a column number argument. I can simply close the formula, press enter, and we get Mr. Maker. So there you have index and match formulas in a nutshell. Now there's a lot more to the index function than meets the eye. And most Excel users never get past this simple index and match use but I recommend you take a few minutes to check out my video on five secret index function features. It's linked to in the video description. Well, I hope you found this tutorial useful. You can download the Excel file containing the examples for this lesson from the link here. And if you like this video, please give it the thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more. And why not share it with your friends who might also find it useful. Thanks for watching.